Hey y'all, it's January the 12th, 2018. Y'all, as you might recall, I made a video the other day about a Mr. Chank, Chank Ogre. I made a video about him, about how he's a disgusting individual and he says some pretty darn disgusting things. Now, obviously comedians say disgusting things, but then again, they're comedians. Chank Ogre, I thought I would call him out because Chank Ogre, he's like some sort of purported feminist and things of this nature. He's one of those chicken neck Nellies and stuff. You saw in the video, you saw exactly what I was talking about. That dude was soft, right? That dude, that dude was angel soft, all right? The thing is, Chank Ogre, he, he's, he's suffering for that. He's suffering right now. As well he should be. The thing is, he, he purported his, um, he, he purported his opinions about ladies and the fact that they're inferior and they really need to just bow down to him and stuff like this in all sort of ways. Way back in 2000, right? In about the 2000s, this surfacing is becoming a scandal, right? Actually, it's already a scandal, right? People know about it, <laughs> right? But, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, you know, um, if it were... Uh, if I were Chank Uger in this situation, what I would do, what everybody should advise me to do is shut my damn mouth, deny, 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 and run away. All right. But he didn't deny. In fact, he owned up to all of it, all of his little articles. And there's a lot. There's plenty to go to go and look at. All right. So he owned up to it. And that was a terrible mistake. But he did it. All right. Because he couldn't run away from it. There's too many examples. Anyways, I don't think he would be able to run away from it. But we were talking about checking neck Nellies like himself. All right. No capabilities to take care of a lady for real. No capabilities to protect her and make her feel safe and secure. He never had those capabilities. He's very stereotypical. He's a chicken neck Nelly. All right. And we're talking about that. And we're talking about some of his views when it comes to ladies and how it's very demanding. All right. It's very, very demanding and stuff. It's very, it's childish and it has a rapey vibe to it. A very much a rapey vibe. Anyways, we, disco we discovered that a little while back. All right, and I was watching a video by a man, <laughs> just to keep it going, by a man named David Pacman, and y'all might have heard of him. He's much, he's he's a lot like a Chank Uger, and in that, you know, he he also is a chicken neck Nelly. In fact, he might go even further. I'm about to show you a small clip <laughs> with this guy, and he's wearing a sweater. All right, so you remember what we said about uh, guys in sweaters and stuff. You notice that most people do in the news, they wear like a shirt and a tie and stuff. And what you're going to notice is this guy, he wears a sweater. And let's just take a real, real quick look at him. Real, real quick. And this is not a defense of what he said. I think I don't know of any people on the left who are defending the content of what Cenk said. In fact, I think it's mostly people on the right that are defending the content of what Cenk said. The group Justice Democrat... Alright. We're gonna stop the video right there. You can go check out the video because I left the link down. You can see the whole entire video if you want on his channel. Alright, this chicken neck Nelly in a sweater, basically what he just said right then and there, he said, the people on the right, they condone uh, Cenk's behavior. They, they condone... They condone his views from the past, they condone him. They like him. The people on the right. That's what this guy in the sweater said. He said, the people on the left, they absolutely condemn him. They absolutely do. This is why it's taken them 17 years to discover this and put him under the bus, which is what they just did. I mean, he had to just resign from some big old group that he was a part of. Some democratic group. All right. So the guy in the sweater, Chicken Neck Nelly named David Pacman, what he says is that people on the right they really, they endorse, uh, they endorse the views of a young Chank Ogre. But the thing is, first of all, he wasn't young at all anyways. He was 30 years old writing these things. He was a grown adult individual writing these disgusting things about ladies. Oh, you think he changed his mind or you think he shut up about it? All right, do you think he changed his mind or you think he's just not talking about it no more? Well, I wonder. Thing is, he has a lot to hide, it seems. All right? David Pacman said people on the right, well, they, lo they love uh, objectifying women. They love treating them like dirt and all sort of stuff. They love talking about them in all sort of disgusting, vulgar ways. People on the right, they do it all the time. They love it. That's the kind of stuff that they love. First of all, I got to let y'all know in the whole scheme of things, I'm not even on the right. 
I'm not. You you probably say I'm more leftist, if anything, because I don't care what the hell you do. All right, but in my own personal life, you might say I'm conservative. David Pacman said, uh, conservative people love to objectify uh, women and slander them all in the newspaper and stuff like this and, and talk about them all bad and talk about them like they're objects, like they're damn dirty objects. That's what David Pacman in the sweater said. It's actually absurd. It flies in the face of reality. But this guy wearing a sweater, there's a reason he's wearing a sweater. He wants you to think he's all uh soft he wants you to think that he's uh, he's not trying to uh, bamboozle you he wants he wants to get in good with you uh, look he's wearing a sweater you, you see he's not threatening oh no he's not threatening he's a feminist you know he stands up for women's rights and stuff like that uh, he's, there's nothing dangerous there's nothing uh absurd going on in his mind i mean shoot uh he's a very good boy he, he's never met david pacman in the sweater he don't mean you no harm, all right? Girls out there, it is January the 12th, 2018. And no, you do not want a chicken neck Nelly, all right? I'll holler at y'all later.